In my last video, I showed you how to make an ancient Greek bronze style arrowhead with a socket and a barb at the back. In this video, I'm going to show you how to make an even more ancient style arrowhead that was used in Greece right at the beginning of the Bronze Age. This is the V-shaped arrowhead, and it was very easy for them to mass produce, so it was used for the longest period of time and is very common in the archaeological record. The process for making this arrowhead is pretty much the same as what I used in this last video, so if you want to review the steps in more detail, uh, click on this video link in the description below. But the basic process is to carve a wooden blank. Here's the wooden blank I used to make this arrowhead. Uh, make a mold in the Delft sand and then uh, take out the wooden blank and in that cavity we pour in bronze. The bronze I use is basically tin and scrap copper. It's 88% copper and 12% tin and you just heat it up. So I already made the mold so I'll show you how to make this and then how we attach it to the arrow. I have a little bit of slag on the side and on the tip I'm going to cut off with a hacksaw and then run this on my foot powered grinder and uh, then we'll polish it up and it'll be ready to mount on an arrow. So overall the cast went really well and uh, let's go clean this thing up. Now that we have our V-shaped bronze arrowhead all ground down and smooth, we're ready to attach it to the arrow shaft. The arrow shaft had a groove carved into the tip of it which matched up with this arrowhead like this and made a pretty wicked arrow that was used in battle. The way that this arrowhead was attached to the wooden shaft was it had two holes drilled through it and was tied on with thread. I'm going to use linen thread It'll be tied off here at the front through the holes and at the base of the arrow. So let's uh, go drill these holes and then tie off this arrowhead to have a finished product. Here's what our bronze arrowhead looks like after we've mounted it to the shaft using that linen thread through those holes. If you want to learn more about archery history, check out my other videos. I have medieval archery arrows, I have primitive archery, and more traditional archery. And also if you want to learn more about this ancient Greek uh, style arrowhead, click the link in the description below and you'll see where I saw the pictures for how to make this. It has a lot more in depth about how old these were and more in general about Greek archery. Thank you for your support and continue to watch because I'm going to make more arrowheads from the Bronze Age.